a namaste binas to do video on mantras and um let me see exactly what it was that was being asked here um let me find that could you talk about how mantras work and cut through the science behind it why are they given as a deeper practice to advanced students only is it harmful for novices to chant those deeper mantras? Okay. Well, different mantras, mantras are given different times depending on what is the practice one is doing. Okay. Now, I have mantras that are done. Um, beginning mantras, which help to open things, expand things into the heart center. Okay. And then I have other mantras when one has once expanded and reaches a certain level of balance, integration. There are other mantras which work on other things, okay? So everything in the universe is built on vibration, okay? Every thought is a vibration. Every color is a vibration. Every sound is a vibration, Everything breaks down to energy and vibration. Each one, as I said on this path, we don't worship uh, gods as, you know, in idol or as in physical form. We see them as various types of energies. And that specific deity points to a specific type of energy and energetic that one merges with. That's the whole thing of bhakti. You merge with that energetic signal, that energetic transmission, okay? So there are different energetic transmissions for different things. I have a couple videos I'm going to put up that will address these things for you. I think that it will bring you more clarity as to how this works. Um, the first one is talking about, you know, uh, the uh, idea of attraction, okay? How these things work, what different types of thoughts are higher, different ones are lower vibrations, etc., etc., etc. How one thing attracts another, okay? And the next one shows the sound vibrations, how it sets up specific patterns. You can see the patterns form based on the, that sound uh, that's being produced. Okay, so I think this will help you a little bit more to understand mantra. It also depends on who the teacher is, is that's giving you the mantra. Specific teachers will give mantras and it will also be infused with their energy which also aids it to work a certain way, okay? So that's another part of it. Uh, how do we work with mantras? You know, it comes to a point, you know, in your path and you just understand. It's an, it's an understanding that comes. It's just like, boom, like that. One day, all of a sudden, you understand how these things work together, you know? That's why... Uh, I put out a mantra, which is a full mantra. Everybody knows the first part of it. The second part of it is newly introduced. And when you do that mantra, it's a whole mantra. Okay. So again, this is how these things work. Uh, when you do the contemplation of self practice, it aids you in expansion. Okay. So again, all these things have to work on vibration, okay, to set up new patterns. So I hope this has helped to understand some. I will put those uh, links to those videos underneath so that you can see how these things work, okay? So thank you for asking that question, which reminds me, um, I have some things that I want to, that I've still got to get taken care of as far as the online ashram with some people ready to move forward, deeper things. And uh, so I want to get those things out for people uh, very soon. Okay, so namaste. Thank you for asking that question.